the, the goal of the managing the risk may be completely opposite the project because you have to deliver that kind of like that benefit at the end of the day. Over. Yeah, I think it's it's an interesting thing, you know, you, in, in what we're going to talk about, I'm going to go to the next chart because this kind of brings up this topic that we, that both Mohammed and I kind of worked on and, and kind of introduced to the lexicon of, of PMI. And then this is this, this issue of inheritance, right? That you shouldn't look at the standards, the portfolio program and project standards is like, what, oh, I have to fit within these three confines, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You, how you organize within your organization, whether you're in a government, a non, you know, a, an NGO or a commercial company, or, you know, your uh, collaboration between two companies, however you're going to be structured, the standards are giving you a general framework to use. And so one of the things we wrote into the standard this round, and, and I'm hoping that it's going to then get picked up in the next round of the project and the portfolio standard, is this concept of inheritance that if you're a project manager that has no program or portfolio manager above them, then you as a project manager need to think a little bit about program and portfolio principles and domains also, right? You, you, you're not, you, you, if you're out there by yourself, you need to have a little broader view where if you're a project manager let's say where I work, like in the Defense Department, where there are literally, uh, 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 you know, like 70 or 80 portfolio managers that are managing multi-billion dollar accounts every year, no less the assets that they own, right, which is in the trillions, right, um, that a project manager in that environment has a program manager above them who then has a portfolio management, and there's decisions being made, and that project manager just has to fit within that box that they're being given. They're doing cost schedule performance, and they're kind of in that box, and, and, and they don't have to be as concerned about the broader areas because there's management above them that are being concerned about that, where you may have project have a program manager, but you don't have a portfolio manager. 